some of you guys may have opened up Elementor recently and noticed this prompt pop up in front of you guys. And this is some really exciting news. Elementor is the ultimate drag and drop page builder plugin for WordPress. And now it's taking things to a whole new level of speed and ease of use for anyone who's trying to build a website. It's introduced three new AI tools that you guys can use inside the page builder and you get a free trial to use it on any website you want. To get started using Elementor's AI tools, we first need to have a WordPress website set up and running by selecting a domain name and hosting. So I always recommend using Hostinger for the best hosting experience and the most affordable price. So if you guys want to get started with your hosting plan with a huge discount, you guys can click on the first link that's down in the description, or you guys can just go to creatorprowebsite.com slash Hostinger, and it'll take you to a page that looks like this. From here, you can select your hosting plan, and I always recommend the premium and business plan for the most bang for your buck. This also includes a free domain name for the first year, which is pretty cool. After selecting your hosting plan, you just need a domain name, and then we can dive into WordPress and start using the AI tools. I'm going to open up our homepage and just jump right into Elementor. Now, the first AI tool that I want to talk to you guys about in Elementor is the AI text generator or the content generator. Some of you guys may have already noticed this because they've had it for a little while now, but I want to show you guys what it can actually do because it's pretty powerful. It's basically similar to ChatGPT where it allows you guys to create unique and persuasive copy that hooks on your readers instantly by entering a quick AI prompt. Inside of Elementor, anytime you have the option to edit text like a heading widget or a text editor widget or even a button, for example, right above where you can add the text on the left-hand side menu, you have this little star icon, which is how you guys can open up Elementor's AI beta. You'll be prompted to sign into your free Elementor account, and then now you can use the AI function. From here, you can try writing out content with AI. Now, it'll suggest some prompts down below for you, or you can just write something out on your own like this. I'll let you guys play around with the text generator on your own, but the possibilities are endless. You can have it write entire blog posts, service descriptions, or just captivating content about other sections and so much more. Now here's where things get really cool. On top of using AI to generate text, you can also have it edit text that you already have on your site as well. And there's two ways that you can do this. The first is you can regenerate text if you don't like how it's phrased like this. If it's way too long, you can always click on the make it shorter button and also vice versa to make it longer. You can also choose to simplify the language or fix spelling and grammar issues. I was impressed that you can even choose the tone of what the text is on your website, which is pretty cool. Now on top of generating text, Elementor AI text generator can also translate your text into any language that you want it to. I thought this was an incredibly useful feature for those of you guys who have a website that you know is going to attract web visitors from different countries. You can now translate different parts of your website with the click of a button using Elementor's AI, which is pretty powerful. Elementor's second AI tool that I want to talk to you guys about is the new image generator, which is probably my favorite tool out of all three of them. Now you don't even have to use AI image generators like Dolly or Midjourney. You can simply add a new image widget on your website and then just click on the create AI button and you're ready to go. From here, you can just enter in your own AI prompt for what kind of image you're looking for. And then you get to choose the image type and then the image style. And then finally, you can choose the aspect ratio and then generate your image. This is so freaking cool. I'm really excited that Elementor introduced this feature into its page builder and I definitely see myself using this in the future. Not only can you create images using AI, but you can also edit images that you already have on your website using Elementor's AI generator as well. Once you select an image that you already already have on your website and that you want to edit, you can click on the edit with AI button and then you can choose to expand the image, use generative fill, resize the image, or you can create variations of the image. And now you have two brand new options where you guys can remove the background or replace the background as well. If you expand the image, you can choose the aspect ratio and then you can also choose how much you want to expand it by. You can also enter in a prompt to clue in the AI tool a little bit more as to what you want. And just like that, I can expand this image just like this. You can use the generative fill tool to select a part of your image and then you can make a change to it using AI. Now this feature doesn't always work the best, but it's still a really cool feature that they have and you don't usually see it in a lot of other AI generators. You can resize the image to a higher resolution like this. You can create variations of the image using AI where you can choose, using a slider, to have the results resemble the prompt more or the reference image. Then you can enter in your prompt, your image type, the style, and then finally the aspect ratio, and now you can generate variations of the same image like this. Lastly, you can remove the background or replace the background with these two options right here. And lastly, you can choose to replace the background of your image as well. All you do is just enter in the prompt of what you want to to be in the background of your image, and then AI is just going to take care of the rest. I was so impressed with Elementor's image generator, and I'm really excited to use it for future projects, trust me. The last tool that I'm going to talk about today is Elementor's AI code generator. You can now use the code generator to create custom HTML widgets, and your imagination is the only thing that limits you. Inside of Elementor, you can click on the add widget button, and then search for the HTML code widget. 
This also works for the shortcode widget as well. Next, you can drag in the HTML widget anywhere on your website and then click on it and you can use the write with AI button. From here, you can check out their suggested prompts down below or you can just write your own prompt and play around with that. I've created a heading widget where the text continuously slides to the left on loop and I've also created buttons where the background is constantly changing color. You can also play around with the suggested prompts like using an iframe to embed a Spotify widget onto your website. Check this out. But instead of using an ID, I'm just going to copy the link of the album that I want displayed on my website so I can just make an adjustment to the prompt like this. Now most of you guys probably already know how to use the AI text generator because it's just been around for a while and it's included in the free version. However, the image generator and the code generator give you a pretty extensive free trial but afterwards you're going to have to sign up for Elementor's AI plan which you guys can find on their website. You'll also notice that the plan comes with 18,000 credits and it's about $3 a month. And for those of you who are curious about what the credits mean, here's a little breakdown for you. Text prompts are one credit as well as code prompts, but image prompts are 33 credits every time you use them. So you wanna make sure that you guys are using them wisely. Now, if you guys are anywhere near as impressed as I am with Elementor's integrated AI tools and you guys wanna get started using them today, but you don't have a website, don't forget to check out Hostinger's hosting plans to get started. I've got a ton of videos on the channel where I show you guys how to create a website from start to finish using Elementor. So if you guys are interested in trying to build your first website today, click on that first link that's down in the description. And just to make things easier for you, you guys can check out this video right here where I show you how to build a website from start to finish using Elementor's powerful tools. I'll see you guys there.